Hey guys, this is Paul from Wondershare Mobile Trans and welcome to another video. And today we are gonna make your life just that little bit easier because we are gonna talk about a common problem that people have so much. And let me tell you what that problem is straight away. And you might have experienced it. Have you ever tried to move any files from your phone over to a computer or an external hard drive and found it to be an absolute nightmare? One of the reasons that you might need to transfer your data away from your device might be that your phone storage is full and you might need to download a film for going on holiday quickly or you might need to download a really important app right there and the only way to do that would be to delete some precious photos or videos from your device to never be seen again. So in this video today I will show you some really quick easy methods on how you can transfer your data, your photos or videos from your device over to an external hard drive. Before we continue though, make sure that you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any of the videos that we have coming up here on Mobile Trans because we update videos weekly and give you some tips and tricks to make your life in a technological space just that little bit easier. And of course, if you like this video, then why not give it a like as well. But let's get into today's video. Over the years, transferring your media from an iPhone to an external hard drive has been an absolute nightmare for iPhone users. It's not been easy, it's been tricky, and it's actually been quite difficult. And even with the use of a computer, this could actually be quite difficult. And something like this should be nice and easy to be able to transfer media from your iPhone to an external hard drive or to a computer. And with our first method, we wanna introduce you to something which makes this extremely easy and makes it have no hassle at all. So let me introduce you to the app called Mobile Trans. While there are several other options for transferring data from your iPhone to an external hard drive, Mobile Trans is by far the most popular. This invention was geared towards simplifying the process of transferring data from an iPhone to another device. And Mobile Trans allows you to transfer iPhone photos to an external hard drive with just a few clicks. It can also move 18 different types of data between 6,000 plus devices. And including that, what you can do is you can transfer data from WhatsApp from one device over to another nice and easily as well. You can also back up 18 plus types of data from Android to iPhone and then to PC and export photos from phone to PC, whether that be Mac or Windows. The first thing of course is to make sure you get your external hard drive and your iPhone connected to that computer. And then I will talk you through the next few steps. Once your iPhone and hard drive are connected, the first thing you'll need to do is select phone transfer and then select export to computer from that drop down menu. After you finish the first step, a window will appear that will list all the data types transferred from your iPhone. Choose the photos you want to transfer to the connected hard drive from the many available options. After that, simply click the export button to continue. A pop-up window will appear allowing you to choose to save your iPhone photos to the hard drive connected to your computer. After just a couple of minutes, your photos will then be saved to that external hard drive and you can view them there. And Mobile Trans makes this really easy, it makes it efficient, and it makes it quick to do that transfer. But Mobile Trans is not the only option out there for people who want to transfer their media from their phone to an external hard drive. So let me talk you through a few different options that you might want to have a look at. And first is to use Windows. Using Windows Photos is one of the simplest ways to actually move photos and media from your iPad or your iPhone over to an external hard drive and all Windows PCs have this built in and the process is really simple. So let me talk you through how exactly you would do it. Connect the iPhone to the PC with a USB cable, then open the Photos app once the connection is established. The Photos application can be found in the start menu of your Windows computer. Once the app has appeared, click on the import option in the top right corner. The next step is to choose which images you want to import. Check that the external hard drive you want to transfer the image to is connected to the PC. Proceed with the import photos and select the external hard drive as the saving space to start the transfer. 
There we go, that was nice and easy, but for Windows, there's also a second option as well, and that is to use the File Explorer to save your photos to an external hard drive. So let me talk you through the steps that you need to get this one done. Just like the previous methods, the first thing you need to make sure that you do is connect your iPhone to the PC using that USB cable. Next, plug in the external hard drive to the computer. Then, when you connect the iPhone, you will receive a prompt asking you to approve the iPhone. Inside the Windows Explorer, go to PC and select the Apple's iPhone internal storage. From there, you go to the DCIM, and this is where you'll find all the images. Now, just copy these images and paste them directly into that external hard drive. Now, iCloud is one of the easiest ways to be able to copy your photos from your iPhone over to your external hard drive, and it's a really simple way to do it. So just follow these steps to make sure you can copy your photos by using iCloud. First, you need to enable iCloud Photos on your phone and then go to the iCloud site on your computer. The next step is to sign in with your Apple ID and click on the image section. Now, select as many photos as you want to download. Either change the download location to your external device or download the images to your computer and then copy it to the drive. You, of course, need to make sure that you have a data connection for this to work. And, of course, all the photos that you download then from iCloud will take up that amount of space in your external hard drive. But that is a really simple, easy method. And we still have another method for you. So let me show you what our next method is. The next option is to use a piece of software on your computer, on a Mac computer, called Image Capture. And this allows you to copy your photos from your iPhone over to your computer in a similar way that you can do to using the Windows Photo app. But it is just slightly different, so let me talk you through the steps you would need to do to make sure you could use this. First, connect your iPhone to your Mac, and you can do it by using either a dongle or a USB cable. Just as you create the connection between your Mac and iPhone, you will receive a question asking if you can trust the computer. You might see this and you might not, but make sure you go ahead and confirm. Then make sure you browse the Mac for the app called Image Capture. Then the app will open up nice and quickly. In the left portion of the Image Capture app, make sure you just select iPhone and then within it, you will see all the images. Next, select the location where you want to save the photos. Then select the photos and click on the import button. Once the data has been imported, you can then transfer the data to an external hard drive. That again is a nice simple method to be able to use image capture. But what if you want to use the Photos app on a Mac? Well, let me talk you through the steps to use the Photos app. Open the Photos app on the Mac and connect your iPhone and it will start showing the device in the sidebar. You can then import the data into the photo library and export the images to the external hard drive. So that one is really quick and only a couple of steps and might be one of the options you might want to look at. But what if you want to use something else? Well, there is still another option for you as well. The option available to you would be to stick a hard drive or USB stick straight into your iPhone and move images over in that way. One of the best options is SanDisk as that has a lightning connector on the USB and you can plug that straight into your computer and move your photos over that way. So online there are hundreds of different ones of these but it's good to go with a quite a reputable brand and SanDisk is one of the best brands out there. And if you want to do this all you have to do is then select the photos you want to move move them over to the Files app within the iPhone and then save them on that external hard drive. And it is that easy, nice and easy, done in just a couple of minutes. Then you have your photos saved onto an external thumb drive plugged directly in to the iPhone without the use of a computer. There you have it, a load of different options in this video for you to be able to save your media and photos from an iPhone to an external hard drive, whether you have a PC or a Mac. And remember the first method that we showed you, which was mobile trans. 
Mobile Trans helps you move all of your data over nice and quickly. And as well as that, you can move your WhatsApp chats from one device to another, from Android to iPhone or vice versa. And of course, you can do backups as well. So if this is something that you like the sound of, then go and have a look at the Mobile Trans website by clicking the link in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, then why not give it a like and of course subscribe to the Mobile Trans channel as well to make sure you don't miss out on any of the videos that we have coming up in the next couple of weeks. And if you do all of that, I will see you in the next video.